the alphabet box letter A. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? A is for... Well done! A is for aeroplane. Aeroplanes fly high in the sky and bring people to many different places. A is for... You are correct. A is for anchor. Boats use anchors to stop them from floating away. A is for... Yes, A is for ant. Ants like to travel with their friends and are strong. They can carry a leaf on their back. Are you ready for the last one? A is for... That is right, A is for apple. Apples make a healthy and sweet snack. Yummy! Well done for naming all the items that start with the letter A. See you next time. The alphabet box letter B. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? B is for... Yes, B is for bird. Birds like to eat Grandpa Pig's seeds. B is for... That's great. B is for book. Daddy Pig always reads Pepper and George a book before they go to sleep. B is for... Wonderful! B is for butterfly. Do you know what colour it is? That's right! This butterfly is blue. Blue also starts with a B. This is the last one. B is for... Excellent! B is for ball. Pepper and George love playing catch with their toy ball. Well done for naming all of the items that start with the letter B. See you next time. Alphabet box, letter C. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? C is for... That is right! C is for crab. Did you know they walk sideways? C is for... Very good. C is for camera. You use a camera to take photographs. Say cheese. C is for... Good work. C is for castle. Maybe a princess is living inside. Here comes the last item. C is for... You are right. C is for carrot. Carrots are very good for you. Well done for naming all the items that start with the letter C. See you next time. For that box, the letter D. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? D is for... That is correct. D is for drum. You can hit a drum to make music. D is for... Well done. D is for duck. Ducks always come to visit Pepper during picnics. D is for... Wonderful. D is for daisy. Daisies grow in Grandpa Pig's garden. Last one now. D is for... Excellent. D is for dinosaur. George loves dinosaurs. Do you know what noise dinosaurs make? Dinosaur. Grr. Well done for naming all the items that start with the letter D. See you next time. Alphabet box. The letter E. What do you think we will see today in the alphabet box? E is for... Brilliant. E is for egg. You can fry eggs. Boil or scramble them. E is for... That's right. E is for easel. This easel is holding a very pretty painting, don't you think? E is for... You are correct. E is for envelope. 
Mr. Zebra the postman delivers letters in envelopes. Here is the last item. E is for... You are correct. E is for eye patch. This eye patch is from Danny Dog's pirate costume. Aha! Well done for naming all the items that start with the letter E. See you next time. Alphabet box, the letter F. What do you think we will see today in the alphabet box? F is for... Excellent! F is for frog. Do you know what sound frogs make? F is for... Fabulous! F is for flute. A flute is a musical instrument you hold sideways to play. F is for... Well done! F is for feather. Feathers are very light and help birds fly high in the air. Are you ready for the last one? F is for... Fantastic! F is for football. Football is sometimes called soccer in other countries. Well done for naming all the items that start with the letter F. See you next time. The alphabet box, the letter G. What do you think we will see today in the alphabet box? G is for... Wonderful! G is for globe. A globe is a kind of map of the Earth. It shows all the oceans and countries of the world. G is for... Great guess! G is for goldfish. Did you know there are over 200 types of goldfish in the world? G is for... Well done! G is for gnome. You can decorate the garden with gnomes. Are you ready for the last one? G is for... Great! G is for guitar. Madame Gazelle is very good at playing the guitar. Well done for naming all of the words beginning with G. See you next time. For bed box. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? Is for... Excellent! Is for helicopter. Helicopters don't have wings, so they use rotors to fly in the air. Is for... That's right! Is for hen. Hens lay fresh eggs, which you can eat for breakfast. Delicious! Is for... Brilliant! Is for honey. Honey is made by bees. Is for... Hooray! Is for hammer. Mr. Labrador uses a hammer when he builds houses. Well done for naming all of the words beginning with... For the bed box. Eh. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? Eh is for... Indeed, eh is for igloo. An igloo is a house made of blocks of ice. Brrrr! Eh is for... Correct. Eh is for insect. Insects have six legs. You can count them to check. Eh is for... Brilliant! Eh is for invitation. Pepper gets lots of invitations to birthday parties. Well done for naming all of the words beginning with eh. Bed box, j. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? J is for... Well done, j is for jelly. Jelly is a jiggly dessert. Jiggly also starts with J. J is for... Excellent! J is for jar. This jar has jam in it. Do you know what letter jam starts with? 
That's right. Jam starts with a J as well. J is for... Fantastic. J is for Jack in the Box. A Jack in the Box will give you a big surprise. J is for... Jolly good. J is for juice. You can make juice from many types of fruit and vegetables. Here is Joey Kangaroo, drinking a healthy carrot juice. Well done for naming all of the words beginning with J. The alphabet box K. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? K is for... Excellent! K is for kite. Peppa loves to play with her kite on windy days. K is for... Correct! K is for koala. Koala bears are from Australia and eat eucalyptus leaves. K is for... You're right! K is for kettle. A kettle is used in the kitchen to heat water for drinks. Always be careful near hot food and drinks. K is for... Good job! K is for kebabs. Kylie Kangaroo loves the kebabs that Mr. Kangaroo makes on the barbecue. Well done for naming all of the words beginning with K. The al alphabet box uh. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? Uh. It's for... Lovely! Uh. It's for ladybird. In some countries, ladybirds are also called ladybugs or lady beetles. Uh is for... You are correct. Uh is for lamp. This lamp needs a new light bulb. Do you know that light bulb also starts with the letter... Uh, uh is for... Good work. Uh is for lunchbox. This lunchbox has a sandwich and an apple inside. What a healthy lunch! Well done for naming all of the words beginning with U. Uh. The alphabet box. Hmm. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? Hmm. Is for magnificent. Hmm. Is for magnifying glass. George uses a magnifying glass to look at the detail on small objects and insects. Mm. It's for marvelous. Mm. Is for maracas. Maracas are musical instruments that you shake. Do you know what maracas sound like? Mm. It's for that's right. Mm. Is for mask. This mask has been decorated with feathers, glitter, and shiny paper. What a lovely mask! Most impressive. Mm. It's for. Correct. M mm is for melon. Mummy Pig buys melons at the supermarket. Delicious. Well done for naming all of the words beginning with M. Mm. The alphabet box. M. Mm. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? M mm is for... Terrific. M mm is for necklace. Mrs. Tiger wears a pearl necklace. It is her favourite. Mmm is for... That's right. Mmm is for nest. Birds keep their eggs warm in a nest before they hatch. Mmm is for... Well done. Mmm is for newspaper. Daddy Pig reads the newspaper every morning to find out what is happening in the world. Well done for naming all of the items beginning with the letter M. Mm. Alphabet box O. Oh. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? O oh. is for... Good work! O oh is for orange. An orange is a juicy fruit that has the same name as its colour. O oh. is for... That's right. O oh is for octopus. An octopus has eight arms to wave with. O oh is for... Outstanding. O oh 
is for olive oil. Grandpa Pig loves to pour olive oil on his salads. Mm. Yummy! Well done for naming all of the items beginning with the letter O. Alphabet box P. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? P is for... Perfect. P is for perfume. Grown-ups spray perfume on themselves to smell good. They can smell of fruits, flowers and leaves. P is for... Excellent! P is for pie. Careful, this fruity pie just came out of the oven. P is for... Wonderful! P is for postcard. Mr Zebra delivers postcards to Pepper when her friends go on holiday to faraway places. P is for... Well done! P is for pancake. Daddy Pig loves to flip pancakes and eat them with maple syrup. Delicious! Well done for naming all of the items beginning with the letter P. Alphabet box K. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? K is for... Quite right! K is for quail. Quails lay eggs, just like chickens and other birds. K is for... Correct! K is for quilt. A quilt is sewn together from many pieces of fabric. Look at all the beautiful colours and patterns. K is for... Well done! K is for quill. A quill is a pen made from the hollow stem of a feather. When Madame Gazelle was young, she used to write with a quill. Well done for naming all of the items beginning with the letter K. Alphabet box K. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? K is for... That's right! K is for rubber duck. Rubber ducks love baths and are very good at floating. K is for... Remarkable! K is for rocket. Rockets fly astronauts up into space. Her is for... Great! Her is for radio. The radio plays many different types of music. What's your favourite music to listen to? Her is for... Excellent! Her is for rose. Roses are very beautiful flowers and come in many different colours. Granny Pig's favourite coloured roses are pink. Well done for naming all of the items beginning with the letter R. The alphabet box Ps. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? Ps is for... Well done. Ps is for seed. Seeds start out small, but with a little sun, water and care, they can grow into something amazing. Psst is for... Super! Psst is for sandwich. Pepper and her friends love eating sandwiches on their picnics. Psst is for... Excellent! Psst is for suitcase. Mummy Pig packs her suitcase with lots of warm weather clothes when she goes on holiday. Well done for naming all of the items beginning with the letter S. The alphabet box T. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? T is for... Terrific! T is for tortoise. This is Tiddles the tortoise. He likes to climb trees and hibernate in the winter time. T is for... Excellent! T is for teapot. Mr. Bull's favourite teapot is made of delicate china. He needs to be very careful so he doesn't break it. 
He likes to add milk and lemon to his tea. T is for... That's right. T is for toothbrush. Pepper and George brush their teeth in the morning and at night to keep their teeth clean, healthy and strong. T is for... Great job! T is for top hat. Top hats are very tall and were often worn in the olden days. Daddy Pig wears his top hat when he wants to feel fancy. Well done for naming all of the items beginning with the letter T. The alphabet box uh. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? Uh. It's for... That's right! Uh. It's for umbrella. An umbrella will help you stay dry. So don't forget your umbrella when it rains. Uh. It's for... Well done! Uh. It's for Ultrasaurus. Ultrasaurus was a huge, long-necked dinosaur. Uh, is for... Wonderful! Uh, is for underground. Rebecca Rabbit and her family live underground. Their underground home is called a burrow. Well done for naming all of the items beginning with the letter uh. The alphabet box. <laughs> what do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? <laughs> it's for. Very good. <laughs> is for vase. Vases can come in many sizes, shapes, and colors. Mrs. Zebra can use her pottery wheel to make a vase in her shop. <laughs> it's for. Excellent. <laughs> is for violin. A violin is an instrument you can play by moving the stick, which is called a bow, across the strings. <laughs> Violins take a lot of practice to play well. <laughs> it's for... Fabulous! <laughs> is for vegetables. Look at all these vegetables. Can you believe they all came from Grandpa Pig's garden? How many vegetables can you name? <laughs> it's for... Impressive! <laughs> is for vacuum cleaner. Mummy Pig uses the vacuum cleaner to suck up dust and crumbs from the carpet. It is quite loud, but cleans very well. Well done for naming all of the items beginning with the letter <laughs> The alphabet box wha. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? Wah is for... Wonderful! Wah is for worm. Worms are very helpful in Grandpa Pig's garden. They make the soil nice and healthy so plants can grow big and strong. Wah is for... What a clever clogs! Wah is for wand. Witches and wizards use wands to cast all sorts of silly spells. Wah is for... Well done! Wah is for whistle. Daddy Pig uses a whistle when he's the referee during a football game. Well done for naming all of the items beginning with the letter Wah. The alphabet box X. Yeah. Z. What do you think we will see in the alphabet box today? X is for... Exceptional! X is for xylophone. A xylophone is a fun musical instrument you can play by hitting the bars with mallets. Yeah. is for... Yes! Yeah. is for yo-yo. Yo-yos are fun toys that go up and down on a string. There are tricks you can perform with a yo-yo as well. Z is for... Correct! Z is for Zoe Zebra. Zoe's favourite thing in the whole world is her toy monkey. Well done for naming all of the items beginning with the letter X. Yeah. Z.